Hey everybody, Austin here with some more Let's Play The Binding of Isaac. Let's do another challenge run. Been having some good success, so we start out with Dr. Fetus. Ooh. All right. Looks like my tears now are bombs. Alright, I have a feeling with her, if we're going to be this powerful, that means we get no item room. And looks like we have our items, the remote detonator. It's nice that we should be able to go to all secret rooms and blow up all tented rocks. That's how we do. So it looks like the bombs have a delay, so it kind of makes it a little harder for enemies like that, but. Should be able to get to five is just fine. So far, my runs on the challenge runs, like the first four rooms, I didn't have the best luck on. But so far, but these uh, rooms five and four and five, I've done great on. So hopefully, I'm just getting better at Isaac. Took a little red heart damage. Means I probably won't be able to get an angel room or an item room or not item room, a uh, devil room. We found out over guess. I was watching BizNap, I think yesterday, and we discovered that apparently the formula we thought for Devil Rooms and Angel Rooms was wrong. How it's not just no damage, red heart damage on the boss, but no red heart damage throughout the whole floor. Alright, so we found the super secret room. Let's get rid of these. Again, moving enemies are a little bit harder. Key, and we might as well, because we're not going to have any item rooms, might as well open these. They might be our only chance to get an extra item, but lots of bombs, which is kind of a troll because, well, we don't really need them. Oh, and we found our secret room, which gives us some coins. Let's just get rid of those fires. And let's just bomb our way into the item room. We might as well. Our shop. Let's see what we have. Ladder for seven cents. Might as well. So the ladder allows us to go over one, um, one head gaps. So let's go fight our boss. Duke of Flies. So this might be a little harder one. Maybe not. We might be able to actually beat him pretty fast, which we did. I think the hard part is going to be getting all of his fly minions. Or maybe not. <sighs> Excuse me. Alright, so we got Pageant Boy, which gives us, I believe, 7 cents. So let's go to the next floor. We are now here. Alright, we found the key and our secret room already. And we have an arcade, which we might go to. Some hearts, alright. So with that, that's going to actually make going to the arcade very viable. Because we can now gamble, or we can now play this as much as we want. Up as much money as we want. All right. I'm not gonna play you yet because let's go back in here. One, two. And let's play a little more. Lots of money. Uh, let's get some hearts and then go look around a little bit more. I don't want to bore everyone by just playing that non-stop, though it would be nice to get that extra heart. If it pays out with the extra heart, it might also pay out with the IV bag. But let's see what else is on the floor. Oh, that's dangerous. Be careful I just can't randomly start shooting tears going into a floor. Alright, we're getting lots of keys, which is again kind of a troll because there's no item rooms, but now we can open up all of the uh, chests that we want to. And we got a health up. Awesome. At least we're not getting trolled like that. Let's bomb you here. Let's bomb you here. Nothing so far. Let's bomb that poop. What are we going to get here? Another key. And a bomb. 
Uh, the biggest trolls of them all. Alright. It's not the way we want to go. Well, let's go ahead and play that blood bank a little bit more. We at least we know we're gonna have enough money for the shop. And the shop can't be greed. Greed doesn't show up until on the first three floors, is from what I've heard. There we go. And we got is that the blood bag or the IV bag? The blood bag, awesome. So we got full health and another heart. So we're now up to five hearts, two spirit hearts, so feeling pretty good about that. Let's check for the secret room. Nope. Found our shop, let's go in it. And the map. We will take the map. I uh, don't need the key. It looks like our secret room was up here, so just in the, in the purpose of not having to backtrack, let's go just blow it up. Let's go look at our secret room right now. And lots of money. So we should be pretty good for money for the rest of this run, I think. We should be able to buy a lot of stuff. We at least can buy what's over in the next item room. Don't want to go to the curse room. Oh. This might be a little harder, but maybe not. Just gotta get him. Okay, I damaged myself. There we go. And we got another health up. So let's go see what's our item room there. Can get Guppy or. Is that the pact? I don't really want to guppy because I don't want to go spirit hearts. Let's pass. I'm feeling we might be able to get some angel rooms on the next time. Alright, so our secret room's already right here. And more money. Got nine more cents, we're above 30, so we should be able to buy out the next two shops. In theory. Oh. Let's keep looking around. So. Things that would be nice to buy. A com well, we have the map, so getting the compass would be a really nice synergy with us. If I can get that bomb to place properly. Alright. There we go. And another spirit heart. A little bit extra more protection, which is good. Uh, let's check the wall there. I think that was actually just planting the bomb, not my bomb fetus. Okay, got that. We got another key. Nothing there. Nothing there. We found our shot right away. And we found probably the super secret room. So let's grab this. Let's see what we got. Alright, well we're gonna wait till we beat the boss for that, just in case we take some damage, but that should give us another heart. Everything here is crappy. We don't want any of that. So let's move on to the next floor. So we gotta find our way to the boss. Really no way to get out of that. Kind of trapped myself there. These guys kind of suck because you gotta get the bombs planted just right. Oh, some damage. Right, stuck again. Let's get out. Let's just let's just go to the next floor. Those guys are tough to beat. Oh, and we got a pill. So I took some red heart damage, which is gonna make it a little bit harder for me to. get the devil room, or an angel room on this floor. Shoot. So can just bomb our way- can I not bomb my way out of this room? There we go. And I might die. Alright, one down, two to go, one to go, alright, let's just use our pill, bombs are keys, alright, not that it really does anything, 
well. Alright. I might actually die on this run now. I got one hit left. Let's not die here. Oh well. This would be bad if I die. Wow. Okay. Well, let's try that again. I'm pretty sure I can do this. I don't know why that was just some bad play on my part, but this shouldn't be too difficult. I'll look for the rooms. We found the super secret room, which is just hearts. And we found our secret room, too. Which is a slot machine. Nothing to play with on it. Let's focus on getting rid of all this stuff, just in case we can get some cash out of it or something. So that last one was just sloppy pay. I just took those red ones, I just couldn't figure out how to defeat with Epic with Feet Dr. Fetus, but I think I have it now. A better idea on how to handle them. Alright, and there's a lot of coins here, so how much is that actually? That's three, six, ten. So I might be able to buy something in the item shop, might not. We don't have a key for it yet, but we should be able to bomb our way into it. Oh, we'll wait and see how much money we get. We'll wait till we get to at least 15. That's our way to the boss. It is, alright. Let's get that else out of the way. And we got a key. But we will save that for the next room, or if we run into any red chest. Let's see what's just over here. Let's finish it off. We might find some spirit hearts or, or spirit hearts, which would be nice. Nope, a bomb, which again is useless for us. And we might as well just see what's in that shop. Mom's coin purse, alright. Well, actually, let's buy out you. I'd rather have that extra protection. If we get some more coins, which it looks like we probably won't, we'll come back and get Mom's coin purse. Now, because I passed on the Devil Room on that last run, I think I should be, if I don't take any hates, I should be able to get an uh, Angel Room. Oh. Did, but no Angel Room. But we got a keep of me. Let's head down. Found so what's in here? Compass. All right, let's do it. Compass is always good. Took some damage there on accident. Kind of just spawned right into it. Oh, and some damage there. So took some red heart damage. So that's gonna make our chances for a deal with the angel or devil less. Let's see, is this our secret room? No. So we won't be able to bomb our way into the item this time. We'll have to use a key if we get enough that we want to go there. Took some run heart damage. Not the most happiest about, but let's keep going. Use that to check for that way. Take no box. Wow, that was bad of me. Alright, let's keep going. Oh, actually, I will check after this. Got to check for the super secret room. We can easily kill them like that. Awesome. And we found it. Cool. It's a red chest which contains Guppy's head. All right, we'll use it for the orbitals. Oh. Let's go fight the boss. Plus that makes us one third of the way to Guppy. Which getting Guppy would be kinda neat. I've never, I've never gotten Guppy before. Got a key, so might not as well not. No reason not to open it. Careful not to get hit by the fire. 
All right, let's go fight the boss. Boss should be pretty easy to take out, just like that, one hit. But because we took the damage in the room, lowered our chance for a deal with the devil. So more spirit hearts, which is nice. So let's head on down to the caves. It's the curse of the labyrinth, larger floor, but we know where everything's at. So at least where all our in rooms are at. Demon beggar, interesting. Or not demon beggar, just beggar. Let's do it. Key, not really what I wanted. And the health up. That's what I wanted. Very good. Alright, let's take you out. Guppy's head. Gotta make sure I'm using Guppy's head to take spawn those orbitals every single time. so we can't maybe go to the shop. Uh, let's explore a little. Let's do some dodging. Not sure why I'm slowing down so much. This is going to be a tough one to kill. Got him. Another judgment. Huh. We might come back there later. We can, with that sh uh, arcade, we can really make sure we have enough coins for all that stuff. Alright, some of you down. One more down. Alright. Got it. Oh. Almost ran right into that bomb. I can get that key, but I don't really don't need it at the moment. Stop doing that. I need to see if I can get some more spirit hearts. So let's check up here. No, nope, let's check there. No, nope, let's check here. No. Nope. What's in our room? Uh, we'll pass for now. Guppy's head. Uh, if we go this way, let's check down here. No, nope, but we got the key just in case. All right. Oh, and a tinted rock. That's gonna be good. Let's take him out from afar, though. I don't want to actually do damage. Just a chest. Not really what I wanted. Not what I wanted at all, even though the money's nice. I wanted spirit hearts, and we got goat hoof. Alright. Okay, let's check for the secret rooms. Nope. Alright, we found the super secret room. Actually, yeah, we'll play it for a little bit. get some uh, spirit hearts out of it. I think it's enough right now. I don't worry that would punish my red- I was kind of hoping that would have been a red heart room, because then I would be making pain the uh, blood donation much more better, much safer. 
but let's check what's in here. All right, two keys for a red heart. Not really worth it. Tarot card judgment. Wow, we're just getting lots of judgments. Another judgment. Okay. Let's just see what's in here. The Bible? No. So because there's nothing in that shop, let's go ahead and just play some of these judgments we found. Hopefully they'll pay out with a better item. So we need to shoot you here. And paid off with health up on the first one. Awesome. That's always good. So looks like our boss is a long way over here. Spirit hearts. Lots of keys, though. Oh, I still need to find my normal secret room, also. Which could be here. Actually, it could be here. Here. Yep, yeah. alright, so what are we gonna get? Money, alright. 14 cents. Let's go while we're over here, let's just go play that other judgment then. Might pay out with some more health, maybe some spirit hearts. So I need to do this right, I need to do you here. And I need to do, let's just lay a bomb here. We didn't want to accidentally blow him up. One, two, three, four, five. All right, Lucky's foot. Now that we have that, let's do this. Let's go back to that other one because the Lucky foot should make it so that all slot machines should pay out. So we should be able to go over here. Play you and get something every single time. First it's skull. Oh, are you? Two of hearts. Okay. So when well, we got the two of hearts, let's do this. Should I should be able to play myself down the three hearts, then come back and get full health. Times. And let's just play you guys a little bit too, because I should wait on you guys much more too. Awesome. This Lucky's foot should be good. A pill. Let's see what this pill does. Is it? I didn't even see what the pill did. Another pill, which does health up, awesome. And what does this pill do? Range up. Okay. Health up is good to know that's in the rotation.
pretty fly. Cool, got another orbital. Got two keys. Another key. Five cents, alright. And this was our health up. Awesome. We just need to get some red hearts. Oh, what is this? We don't know. Let's check it. Full health. That's awesome. We know there's a full health, so let's play you a little bit more. And let's see if we can get another full health, health pill. You are a... Hello pills. Go back. So with that full health, we can find another full health pill. We can safely play that more to get more money. I'm liking this now. I'm happy we stopped the gamble. Alright, so let's play you more. Come on, pay out, pay out, pay out. Money kind of just gives me another play. Health is good. Key. Bombs. I need to let my orbitals take care of that. Money. Alright, so let's do you a little bit more cash. Alright, it paid out with the IV bag. So let's do you one more time. Let's do you one more time. Let's do you one more time. Alright, let's go back and get that health that was at the other end over here, and then we'll go work our way towards the boss. If we had a red heart room, that IV bag would have been awesome. Alas, we don't, but we can pick up our judgment, which we don't have any money to play. Let's work our way back towards the boss. But we did get two full healths out of that, which is nice. So we have lots of health now. Lots of red health. Could just clear the room a little bit more. Two guys, not a problem. Though that was a little scary. And we have a full health there, so we could play the blood, the IV bag twice. All right, the guys who are my bane's my existence last time. All right, much better that time. Rock. That's what I like to see. Whew. And that felt close, but just the small rock. She has a damage up, which not sure how that works with the, with uh, Doctor Fetus. Might give us more damage. I'm not 100 sure. The bomb looks like it's it's tinted, so maybe. Fight this boss, hopefully we take no damage. Pestilence, we should be able to dodge him. There we go. Awesome. Oh, is this an XL floor? Oh, I didn't even realize we're on an XL floor. So let's go fight our other boss then. Fistula. Alright, this shouldn't be too bad. Just a lot of dodging. 
Oh, and we have a second level cube of meat now, which is nice. So we now have a little, some tears. This one's just me more about dodging. We got our deal with the angel. We got wooden spoon, which is a speed up. Let's see what we can get here. So we got prayer card. I'm not sure what that does. Awesome. Gives us a heart there. And then let's just use our judgment and see what happens. We have two coins to play with him. Pay out, pay out. Nope. All right. So... Hopefully I should be able to come back to that. No, All right, I did that wrong. I should have gathered the health, played the IV bag, then went up. But you know what? Let's just keep going. And now we're on the depths. We know that Greed's in the secret room. Greed? Not really. I'd rather just get this floor done with so we could uh, hopefully get another deal with the angel room. Let's just start heading that way. We can always come back later after we're done with the floor. Sad onion, tears up. So how does that affect Dr. Fetus? Doesn't really, okay. At least if it does, I don't know how. Two tented rock. Tented rock right there. Let's go ahead and blow you up. Get to this golden chest. Oh, let me get back. More coins. Now we may actually want to go to the shop here at some point. Let's just blow this up for the other coins. Still need to find the super secret room also. One down. Oh, Alright, took some red heart damage, so that's going to lower our chances of getting a deal with the devil. Okay, let's keep going. Alright, well, let's blow you up over here. Is that Pinky's Eye? I think that's gonna give us maybe... It's supposed to make our tears have poison effect, but I'm not sure how that's gonna affect us with... Uh, this right here. Alright, it looks like we're gonna get a third level cube of meat. Yep, so it looks like it can shoot poison. Alright, so we got that third level cube of meat. Let's go play a little bit more with the floor. You know, we have enough we can look at. We know that greed won't be in the item shop, so let's go take a look at that. We can probably collect enough uh, 
We have enough health on the floor that we can take damage against uh, greed and still be at full health. Plus, we will pop before we go to the next floor. We will pop our. Uh, out some of those guys. One more. Which apparently is not wanting to stick to him. Alright, meet Floyd, do your thing. Awesome. Alright, let's blow you up here. We're fighting Greed, so hopefully we should be able to take out Greed pretty fast. Yep. You could have greed farmed a little bit to try to get some more coins. I'm okay with not. Let's blow down here. This might be our super secret room. Nope. Let's see what's in the shop. We will definitely take you and leave the rest. So now let's see if we can find our super secret room. I'm gonna be towards our other dead end. Oh. Right, so that was stupid of me. up to 15 cents. Okay, though I think we have, we have enough health on the floor, I can rejuvenate. Now this might be our super secret. Nope, are you? Nope, are you? Nope, alright, let's keep looking. Let's just bomb up here just to make sure. Nope. We go up, 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 up and to the right. Is good. So let's check now here. No, nope, let's check here. No. Nope. No, so it's gotta be. Or we just maybe with it being. Maybe we don't have a super secret room? Or maybe it's up here. Yep, alright. Which contains you. Awesome. So this should actually pay off quite a bit. Yes, so we will play you for quite a while. And, and the, the safety cap, right? Well, we know we got some good pills, so we're going to keep the safety cap. And we have enough keys, so let's go ahead and take this half heart. Full heart. Go to the boss room. Take this pills, which takes us exactly back up to full health. Pop our space bar item. And let's head down to the next floor. Which that eternal heart then turns into a full heart. No arcade, but we know Greed is also in the secret room again, so let's head to the shop.
bonds. us to fit exactly 15 and we don't want the portable slot but we'll take the spirit heart more protection or apparently as I was reading somewhere the game code called spirit hearts armor but I guess it kind of acts as armor and we found our super secret room which contains an eternal heart we will save that for later so that kind of sucks that that's what was in there because we'll generate one at the end of the room and when we generate that one and then add it with the one we find there, it'll just give us a full heart. So we really don't need to work our way back here if we don't want to. Some of my least favorite enemies. Hopefully, Meat Boy will help out here. It did. Excellent. I got a key. This is not the way. This might be the way. down, two to go. Take some damage, which I didn't want to take. Want Meat Boy, take him out. Ah. Some more mass. Right, good job, Meat Boy. Good job, Bomb. One more. Got it, good. This will probably be the way to the boss, I'm thinking. We need to stand a little far away. Okay, let's head up. This was our way to the boss. Uh, some damage, which I did not like. Let's go ahead and fight mom. I might be a little harder with this because we gotta get the timing of the bombs right. The meat boy should help us out. Oh, and I don't want to blow myself up. That's the other thing I gotta worry about. Crying. All right, meat boy, take some damage, do some damage. I think a lot of our damage is gonna be done from oh, out the walls. Nope. Ah, oh, just can't get him out fast. Enough. I need to, like, as soon as I see the shadow, I need to start shooting there. That's good. Bad missing. Almost out. Almost picking up mom. Oh. I don't need to make sure I don't die. Oh. Some stupid hits. One more hit, mom's dead. And we took out mom. Awesome. So we got health up and two spirit hearts. So not too thrilled about the amount of damage I took on that floor because that pretty much really hurt me. I can't exit, so let's use our external heart. 
keep going. So I need to find some things I need to find on this room. I need to find the super secret room and hopefully hope that it has red hearts in it because I need to replenish a lot of my red hearts or the enemies need to drop a lot of red hearts for me. There's no shop so I can't buy any hearts. Uh, hopefully maybe find the pill that gives me full, uh, full health. No, nothing there. So this run is far from run yet. This run is far from one yet. Especially when I take damage like that. And our spacebar item is kind of worthless now because we can't generate any more red hearts. Red hearts have a maximum. Oh, we got a chest. Oh. That's the other thing too we want to make sure. We want to make sure we blow up all rocks because any rock can be a tinted rock. They don't differentiate the color here. So we have full tinted rock potential. Health up, which doesn't really give us anything because we're already at maximum health, but we'll take it anyway. And let's keep going. We know our boss is on the other direction, but I just want to do a full clear because again, I want to check for the secret, super secret room, which will hopefully be a red heart room. This was range up. Alright, we found the super secret room, which is nothing. Alright, so let's just start heading towards the boss then. That was not very helpful. Hopefully we'll gain some health on our way there. Oh, let's blow up these rocks. I'd like to fight one of the four horsemen so I can get a super a level four meat boy. Never actually had a level four meat boy before. Oh, some damage there. I think I'm out of spirit hearts now maybe. Can't tell because they're off the screen. Don't know what this is. Bad gas, alright. A little scary. Oh, and we found our secret room, which is probably going to be cash. You know, maybe it's a chest, or not a chest, but a uh, fortune teller machine. Well, one of them. Alright, let's play you for a little bit, because this money's not worth anything. So we might be able to get some pills or some health out of it. Like, as I guess we might get some health out of it. Pretty fly, okay. We now have two more orbitals. Might get some health out of it. Might get some health out of it. Nope. It's always worth a shot, right? We're now back up to half health. Worthless bombs, which we don't need. Pretty fly. Alright, so now we have three orbitals. So we're at max orbitals now. Get some more health. Really like to get a full health pill. I know you're in the rotation. seem to want to give it to me. The safety cap hasn't really been working either because I don't think I've gotten any pill drops from enemies. Meat boy, take care of him. Alright, let's just blow these up. Because there's a chance they might be tented rocks. Nope. All right, let's keep heading down. It's 
great. When you get to the later stages, you start fighting enemies that were originally just bosses for you as normal, and then you fight. Sometimes, as you notice, you fight two of them. This is gonna be tough to do. Looks like I need to actually lay a bomb. Nope. There we go. That was a little in ingenuity. All right. Take some damage here, maybe. Maybe not. So far, one down, one to go. Meat boy, do your thing. Start chomp, chomp, chomping. Ooh. So I did take some damage. It looks like we are out of spirit hearts. And the thing too with the womb is you take full damage for the half heart damage. But we got a spirit heart out of it, which is nice. rocks. Because again, you never know. Yep, like I said, you never know. Alright, let's go fight our boss. Loki. I don't think I've actually ever fought Loki before. Shouldn't be too difficult. Half of Loki's down already. Just get that second half. And we did get a deal with the angel. Awesome. Let's get this health. And let's see what our item is. The relic. I believe that's going to help us generate spirit hearts every couple of rooms, so... Would've been nice to have it earlier in the game, but it definitely helps. I'm not gonna say no to it. Again, that didn't do anything for us, but we might as well use it. So let's just go ahead and fight our way to the boss. Let Meat Boy do some thing. Pills range up. That doesn't do anything for us. Apparently not, doesn't look like. Let's just search for the room. Let's blow up these rocks. Because you never know. A dead end, so it looks like there's a long way to the boss. Let's just search here. Right, we are gonna want to get that half heart, because every little bit of health helps. And we're gonna want to blow up all the rocks. Especially when there's that many of them, there's a good chance one of them could be a tented rock. just a good chance. Ah, so Meat Boy, what did you do there? Took damage because Meat Boy hit the bomb back at me. Nope. Nope. Alright. Let's just search over here. I'm mainly doing this because I want to see if I can maybe get some spirit hearts out of it. We got a pill. Don't know what this pill is. Health up! So there was two health up pills in this game. Yeah, but I'm already at maximum health. So it would be nice to now find some uh, full health pills. Just to carry on. Hold on me. I don't think I need it anymore, but it still would be nice to hold. So the relic's starting to pay off now. Search for the super secret room. No, all right. Gluttony. I think gluttony might actually pay off with health when you defeat him. Oh, see if I 
I can't hit damaging myself like that. Alright, we gotta get some health, which is nice. Lost some spirit hearts in the process, but at least got some health. Doesn't really make up for it in this case, but, you know, I'll still take what I can get. So nothing there. Nothing there, nothing there. Let's move down. Good chance our secret room is over here, but let's go ahead and get this. More money we don't need. And that wasn't our secret room. So those black rocks we couldn't blow up. Those were indestructible rocks. Stuck with a good bomb, which that might actually be good. Let Meat Boy do some damn chomp chomping. Alright, and we got a pill, which was telepills. So let's hold on to that for right now. And we found our secret, one of our secret rooms. Looks like just the secret room. Let's move down. Angel fetuses, or angel babies, whatever they're called. Those are not fun. Is that our super secret room over here? No. Nope. Well, let's just check out the rocks. Oh, damaged myself on accident. We're out of spirit hearts. But is that the full health I'm looking for? It is. Alright. We're gonna hold on to the full health. We might need it for the boss. Rocks. Oh, I'll go back and search for the secret room in a minute. Let's just search here. Search there. Four at once, that was kind of nice. Let's let Meat Boy get close. Do your thing, Meat Boy. Chomp away. Worthless key. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Oh, took a little damage. So, this is probably here or here. No, I'm not sure where it's at. Alright, so we fight Mom's Heart. enemies for epic fetus or for doctor fetus is those stupid red ones. Alright, so now it's in a permanent bomb state. So we got this in the bag. Will we get the shoal? I don't know. We did take some damage, so it might not give us the double room. 
Oh, now we've unlocked Mega Fetus. And it does not look like it will let us go down. The one shot we have is, let's go back to where a pill is and try telepills. It might teleport us there, if it does. Great. Nope, actually just teleported us farther away. Awesome. Well, let's just head back there, finish the game, and it should be good. So, good run, you know, we've, right now, these last three one, run, or last three videos, we've at least won. I know I lost, I don't know if we're going to count that as, if that can count as a continuous win, but still do pretty well. I think my Isaac abilities are definitely improving. Not that I really needed that, but the completionist in me just wanted to pick it up. And we might as well just use you, because it's not going to do anything. So as we're walking away, let me just say, you know, if you guys enjoy watching my videos, enjoy watching Daily Isaac, you know, please subscribe. Um, please like my video, leave comments, tell me I could have done better. Um, also, please, uh, oh, let's see what the video gives us here. 25 cents, awesome, but I think I already unlocked that. So, you know, keep watching, kind of let us know what you guys are seeing, and I will uh, follow me on uh, Twitter, Hilldog1378, and I'll see you guys next time.